Hello everybody, hope we're all doing well. Welcome back to more esports talk. You know, a lot of drama going on over there in the Twitter universe. Maybe going to touch on that in the future, but the show must go on when it comes time for other news out there. And what does continue to happen is now ongoing allegations and rumors about more cheaters in the Fortnite scene. I'm sure some of you guys watching might be going, oh, no surprise. This one though, it might be a whirlwind of a story we'll keep you all posted on as well as many sources out there now citing the rumors steadily going around about potential pros using what is now called as soft soft aim or potentially have been using it for some time. Now what's been recently happening though is one competitive player being exposed by his own teammates. Got to be careful because you know ever since the dub situation when it comes time for fully confirming a cheater or hacker is very very difficult. He has been exposed and called out by his own teammates though for cheating and using hacks in daily trio cups along with that being the Booga Cup most recently as well. Uh, primarily one of his former teammates that being Zykoma coming forward on Twitter just yesterday with a thread and a few clips to call out B-Man who is now being accused of cheating. As Zykoma took to Twitter to say, so yesterday Buck T, part of my trio, found that our third member B-Man was secretly using hacks without our knowledge during daily trio cups and the Booga Cup. I'm posting this to show how easily these hacks are accessible and go multiple tournaments undetected. He later states, I effing hate this situation and I hate the fact that I have to do this but I can't sit back and watch this happen. B-Man is literally about to play in the Booga Cup because of hacks and no one would have known. He then shows Discord messages with B-Man stating obviously y'all are going to expose me it's okay buck t replies f and b man then says i made a mistake yesterday do it if you want learn my mistakes and deserve the problems that come along the way and then i'll play for you guys a couple of the clips they have now posted and kind of evidence uh, not only those screenshots and messages i'll keep on showing you guys but a couple clips as well apparently of b man using said sheets And then later on, B-Man started denying these claims, so further Discord messages were actually posted, apparently with him partially admitting to, at least in some sense, it seems these screenshots maybe allude to the fact that he cheated at one point or another, but here's what they did say. With one user saying, I don't want to be involved in exposing, B-Man saying, mm, well, cancel culture is so cringe, like actually so effed up. The unknown user says they aren't doing it to cancel. B-Man says, I messed up in a daily, referring to a daily cup, and now I'm getting canceled, dude. With a few more messages talking about, you know, some exposing, to some extent, it does seem, based off those messages, you know, we're assuming they are real as well, that he might have cheated at some point in his past. We've had other pro players be accused of the same exact thing. I must say these are accusations, though, by both of his teammates. And yes, he has now taken to Twitter to deny a lot of these things. And we'll see what comes out about this if Epic Games does respond, because brought to us by Fortnite Intel, other sources as well. These rumors continue to swell of other up and coming pro players or pro players in general who might have been using these undetectable cheats with an anti-cheat not catching everything. As we've seen a lot of games out there, these accusations will continue to surface and the evidence must be there before we make these bold claims. Obviously with B-Man being called out by his teammates, they are making these very, very bold accusations and this will not be the last time we talk about this one, guys. I will leave it on one note as well. I, I take a look on B-Man's Twitter, some of the things that are being sent to him are god-awful. You got to think he is a teenager. And I think a lot of us can maybe kind of overlook these kind of things when you are that young receiving things and threats of this nature towards your family being doxxed as well. It's, t it's a terrifying thing to go through. And if you are sending these messages, please think about what you are doing. It's an awful thing to do, especially to a teenager. We talked about a couple weeks back as well from the Counter-Strike scene, all of these fans and crazy people sending death threats to young, young pros. It, it is a great effect, impact mentally to have to deal with these kind of things because you never know who is making a threat as a joke or who is doing it seriously, and it can really end up being a very serious thing with very serious people being involved as well. 
So please don't, do not do that, guys. It's at the end of the day, think about it. It's cheating in a video game. Yes, if he is cheating, does he deserve a punishment? Yeah, he does not deserve threats on his life or his family's lives either. And I think we can probably all agree on that. Fortnite Pro would continue to be exposed or accused of cheating. And this is probably uh, only, only more yet to come for all of you guys. Until next time, drink that water, drink that coffee. I'll be back here all day long, all weekend long. A lot of crazy stuff going on, as I'm sure you guys are aware, and I will break it down as it comes out. Until next time, take care. I'll see you guys back here sometime soon.